Hi, I'm Tina DeClerc. I'm the system lead for the newest system in the nurse family, Edison. And I'd like to go through a little bit of the Edison configuration and how it works with you. So, this the airflow on the system is a little different than our previous systems. Instead of going from the bottom up, it goes now from left to right. So the first cabinet is a blower cabinet, and then you have two compute cabinets, another blower, and two compute. That's how this system is configured. If you look inside the machine, the way it's cooled is there's a cooling coil on the right side of each of the compute cabinets. And the air pushes through that cooling coil to cool the next system in the rack. Each one of these is a compute module. There are four nodes per module. The right side is compute nodes only. On the left side, you could also have I.O. nodes. The I.O. nodes only have two nodes per module. Those comprise anything from the nodes we use to communicate with DBS or the Lester file systems and the network nodes which allow you to get from inside the machine out to the world. There are three chassis in this machine. So there's one here, one here, and one at the top. So the Aries network works within those chassis. The first level Aries, every node within each of the chassis is connected to every other node in that chassis. So if we move around to the back, now you can see the rest of the Aries network. This, these are the copper cables, all of these colorful ones. These connect each one of the chassis and each one of these two cabinets to each other in an all-to-all -all configuration. And then the final layer are the optical cables. These go through the top and connect every chassis or every cabinet pair to every other cabinet pair in the cluster. And these go through these overhead racks that you see here. Part of the cooling system is done with water, as I said, through some radiators. These are the hoses. We have an in inlet and an outlet. So every radiator, you, water goes up through, it gets heated up, and then it comes back and goes out to our cooling system in the yard. To get a better view of the, what a compute module looks like, we had this set up. So these are your four nodes um, that are part of the compute chassis. There are two CPUs per node and 64 gigabytes of RAM. This is the ARIES module, so that's where all of the network communication goes through. All of these racks, the seven racks in the front, are the three file systems that you use the Lester file systems. So we have two that are at two racks each, and the third one is three. These are made up of an MMU, this is where all the metadata is managed, is in this first part of the cabinet. And then each one of these is an SSU. So this is where your all of the data is, all the disks, and the servers that manage those disks. And then we have the rest of the system. Support system is here. All the login nodes, all the management servers, and everything else is in the rest of these rows, all of the networking that we use. So there is a brief introduction to Edison, the newest system. Thank you very much.